Hi everyone, welcome back to season two of Green Jobs Africa. We're excited to bring you not just the theory of green jobs, but the practical. On this season, we get to share with you stories of amazing entrepreneurs that are making a difference in their communities, that have come up with innovations, solutions that are actually working and they're creating jobs for themselves and for many young people. We'll start with Kenya and hopefully we'll get to you wherever you are in Africa. So stay tuned. My name is Sela Bogonko, co-founder and CEO Jacob's Ladder Africa, and this is Green Jobs Africa season two. Season one of Green Jobs Africa started last year around the Africa Climate Summit because we were passionate about advocating and creating awareness about what green jobs are, why they're important, why we can and should be addressing the issue of youth unemployment in Africa using green jobs. And we managed to share with you, and if you've not been able to watch any of our episodes, please do, because we broke down the whole narrative or the whole story around what is climate, what is climate change, and all the other jargon that you get to hear in this environment. But we stay true to our mission, making sure that everything that we do is about green jobs and how you, as a young African can be able to plug in in one way or the other. And so as we thought about, okay, we've done that, so how else can we bring this home and make it real, tangible, and relevant to you? Well, in season two, like I said before, we get to bring you stories of amazing young people and entrepreneurs. And over the next couple of weeks, you'll get to hear it from their perspective. You'll get to see the practicality of what they're doing. Some of them are in the immobility space. Some of them are in the uh, tech space, you know, coming up with solutions around AI, using AI to be able to resolve the issue of climate. And these are not just narratives. They're not theories. They're actually working and they're earning from them. They're creating jobs. They're being recognized for them. I mean, how much more inspiration do you need as a young person to be able to get into green jobs? We intend to make sure that you have no excuse whatsoever by making sure that we answer all your questions by bringing you examples that will inspire you, motivate you, and challenge you. So stay tuned as we get to interact with these entrepreneurs. We have changed the format of the show to make sure that we delve deep into the stories of the entrepreneurs, but also bring you the background, the journey, the experiences, the challenges, the moments that they felt that perhaps the idea is not going to work and what made them keep going in spite of the challenges. So you have to listen to the stories and please do. So please come along on the ride as we get to experience what Africa has to offer. One of the things that we believe and I personally believe in the reason why we are passionate about making sure that we create jobs, we articulate what it takes to create the jobs is because we know we can. And we have to, because otherwise we're sitting on a time bomb that is called youth unemployment. Africa's population is young and it's only getting younger. And unless we all do something about it, we will definitely be regretting in a few years to come. I'm confident that we will not because we have evidence in so many people uh, and so many stories that we'll be able to share with you on this platform. Like, share, comment, make sure you bring everyone along to listen to these stories and just to inspire yourselves, your young, uh, your friends, and anyone else who cares to listen, and hopefully there'll be many of you. Send me your comments, your questions. If there's a story of a young person who's doing an amazing work in your country, please do let us know, and we'll reach out to them and showcase them on this platform. And hopefully it will change their lives as well as other young people around them. My name is Sela Bogonko, co-founder and CEO, Jacob's Ladder Africa. This is Green Jobs Africa, season two.